hello everyone so today we're going to start with semantic web subject okay uh, as it was suggested by one of our subscriber so we'll start today with this playlist and uh, we'll complete with the unit one so semantic web is basically um, so before diving into the subject let's uh, see some examples and then uh, uh, you can understand these definitions clearly okay now let's say uh, you want to search for a hotel in london okay you are in london and you want to search for a hotel in london and uh, you you are using some uh, traditional search engines which is google or you're using yahoo or some search engines you are using okay what happens usually is you will get a list of websites that will match your keywords okay but you don't get the proper information everything on a single page right you have to uh, break it down into single other other things and it, you're going to find it out in different different websites clear according to the according to the uh, keywords that you're going to give now if you have to go through each one to find the information you need how are you going to do it so in that case semantic web is coming in the picture okay now if we use semantic web which is a search engine basically semantic web is nothing but it is a search engine okay now it will understand what your query is and it will provide you with more relevant results okay now uh, it will provide you with more relevant results and this is because the semantic web is using some kind of technologies what kind of technologies it is using uh, technologies like uh, rdf uh, okay owl uh, and then uh, sp P A R Q L. Okay, these are the three kind of technologies Semantic Web is using because of which we are able to get the exact information what we are searching for, and it is also used to create some kind of web data, web of data, which will make it easier to find out uh, what information be is being used. Okay, now let's come back to the definition. What it is exactly? So Semantic Web is nothing but it refers to a collaborative movement okay it refers to a collaborative movement which aims to improve the way we search and retrieve information on the inter internet okay what is the semantic web basically it is a technology which is allowing data to be connected to be connected the data should be connected it should be shared and it should be reused in different platforms okay and in other words if i say it makes the web smarter by giving some data meaning and some context to it okay this is semantic web now in the next video i'll share all the coming topics you can uh, uh, see the playlist uh, link in the description thank you